Cheers. Cheers. Why is mine so much bigger than you? What did you order? I ordered a cappuccino. Cappuccino? It's a cappuccino. There's no such thing as a cappuccino. Then why am I drinking? Everybody, welcome to the show. I finally have a girl on the show. What? Because I yelled it. Because I yelled your name. I told you we had to be a little bit loud. Okay. We're literally at the back of a coffee shop near the washrooms. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get right into it. Are you ready? Okay. Favorite season of Ninjago. Favorite <laughs> season. Yeah. Favorite season. Okay. Uh, I think my favorite season was when Nia became. Okay, yeah, it was two seasons ago, so it has been, it has been released. When she was the Robo Samurai. Robo? You were Robo? Is it Robo Samurai? Is that what it's no, called? No, Sa it's Samurai X. Samurai X. What's a Robo Samurai? Yeah. Is this your such a thing as a Robo Samurai? <laughs> That's what it is, right? It's a robot samurai. Robot. You were in a samurai suit, right? But it was a robot. You were no, dude. You weren't a robot. It wasn't. No, you were just a cool suit. <laughs> I thought it was a robot. I found this interview. <laughs> no, I swear, Nia built the robot. She built the suit, and then it had all these functions and yeah. weapons and things we could do because it was a robot. A robot. It was like a robo samurai. That she got but nobody. Control. If that's the case, nobody says a robo samurai. That was samurai X or ninja. That's the book. Oh, that's like the, what do I? What do you prefer? That's the most popular question I got for you. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, I like my water powers. Yeah. And I feel like I've been waiting a long time to be a ninja. Um, I I was hoping that I would be revealed as the green ninja. So when Lloyd was revealed as the green ninja, yeah. I you were mad. I was mad about it. Yeah. I, I actually like said something kind of mean to Jillian that day, <laughs> and I feel guilty about it because it was so petty in like junior high. Do you believe that Musako uh, is like a daughter, like you're like a daughter to Musako? Yeah, sure. Yeah, she's the motherly figure of the show. All right, cool. So I miss my real mother, whoever she is. We're not talking real life, right? No. That, I was like, whatever you did. No, <laughs> like Mia. Made my yeah, interview yeah. really sad. And you guys are not recording for the show. Do you call each other by character names? <laughs> <laughs> um, Nia, yeah, we never do that, Nia. Uh, the only person I see outside of work, like just around, is um, is Vincent. And whenever I see him, I'm like, I'm like, that's my brother. He plays my brother. He's my brother Kai. And then I'm like. Do you think you and him would be good brother sisters in real life? Yeah. Yeah. Because you get along. Yeah. He's easy to get along with. So is she. Do you have any pets? No, I have a pet daughter, a baby. Okay, I didn't. It's kind of like a pet. I didn't know if we were allowed to talk about that, but we're okay to talk about that. I put her on Instagram, and my Ninjago people follow me on. On this. Instagram, okay. So it's okay. While we're here, below I'll put her Instagram and Twitter. Go follow her. Right, I don't usually go on Twitter, but I sometimes go on. Twitter. How's the baby? Is the next question actually? Oh. Yeah, convenient. Uh, she's very cute. And this is her sound she makes. Wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's your favorite color? Green. Really? Yeah. Not a lot of people say green. Oh. Why? Because okay. of earth stuff? Or uh, I think. Oh, I think Kelly means green. Kelly is a shade of green. Really? Yeah. See. A lot of them think because Nia's favorite color in the show is a certain color what combination. Is my I forget. I forget. Okay. That, it's red. That, that would be yours. I'm red. Well. Aren't I red? But what is my uh, master of water outfit? I. Yes. Have you ever voiced a male character? Oh, one of uh, one of my first jobs. I played a little boy on Holly Hobby. And uh, I was all, uh, kind of like this. You know what? I keep losing parts to Aaron Matthews. I've been second choice to like for three shows where she got the show and I was like second choice. Did you do that voice for Lloyd? Did you audition for Lloyd? I didn't. I think by that point. What? Why wouldn't you audition for Lloyd? Ten year old Lloyd? Uh, I don't know. Did you audition for any other characters on Ninjago? No. Really? I just thought, and you know what? I You're looked, batting hundred percent. I looked at the script as I was walking into the studio. I was like, oh, I better work on this. And that was 
this is the biggest job I've ever got. Yeah. And. Uh, and you're I, the most unprepared. I'm aware, but maybe it's like that was the role that suited me the best. So yeah. like it, I called upon things that I already did well. Yeah. So I got that one, and you know I tried different things where I try work really hard on an audition, yeah, and, and then I it. don't get it, no. and I'm like, well maybe I should just wing it like Nia on Ninjago, and then I don't get it. It's right. Like, What's your favorite episode in Ninjago? Listen, I I like it when Nia gets some lines. I feel yeah. like the first two seasons I did I had like one line uh, an episode. And then once I finally got more yeah. parts then anytime that Nia actually plays a part in the storyline and I'm like yes. I like the the romance uh see the season between uh Jay and Nia where they really had to like get dramatic like a soap opera. Any Lego uh sets at all? I have the first Ninjago um, Nia figurine. Yeah. I would accept gifts. Gifts, for gifts. Lego, please help a brother and sister out. Yeah. Favorite villain? I I, I like uh, Lord Garmadon at the beginning. Yeah. Good. Nostalgic. Yeah. Um, I let my daughter watch Ninja, Ninjago for the first time, and I'm trying to keep her away from screens for the yeah. first two years of her life. But I was tired last night. And I was like, fine. Well, I I'll watch an episode of Ninjago. You can sit on my lap. She was like. I like drool, like a uh, How old is she? She's six months. Okay, so that's me. Drool coming you out of her thought a baby mouth. Einstein maybe? <laughs> and like, she just like couldn't believe it. And then every time uh, Nia came on, she went, <laughs> Did she know? Did she, I, know? she must have, because she did it more than, <laughs> And then when the Hymno Bride came on, she went, <laughs> And then really? when the Golden Weapons activated, yeah. she was like, <laughs> Do you know how much stimulation that would be for a six month brain? Oh, I know. She was like, I, I like, I didn't know you could sit up. Like, she, her whole body, like, uh, and then drool. Do you think the character um, Nia could survive in Death Note? I don't know anything about Death Note, Ooh. but did you put Nia in Death Note? Mm. I think Nia has a dark, a dark atmosphere. Like, she has some darkness to her, and she could survive in that world. Yeah. Do you have a brother in real life? I have two brothers in real life. Are any of them similar to Kai? Mm, yeah, I would say like my my brother Graham. He's a, very confident in his abilities and likes to tackle problems and physical and funny. Do you like ducks? I think I do like ducks. They're pretty cute. I I like watching them swim. I like that they'll eat anything that you sprinkle in front of them. I'd like to apologize for half the questions. <laughs> Lego Man 4223, thank you very much. Well, I guess what happened in my head, what I was picturing in my head, yeah. was it was like this giant It is a giant thing. I don't know what that is, actually. Maybe that's, I think that might be the outfit you wear inside the Robo Samurai. That one. Okay, there it is right there. Which one do you like here? Blue hoodie detail, thank you very much. Can you do a Nia um, impression from episode 59? I gotta do some stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta solve some problems. I gotta do technical things. I gotta do some fighting. I gotta be like, Kai, you're an idiot. Actually, in episode 59, you didn't do any of that stuff? Actually, in 59, you weren't even in the episode. Has Ninjago ever made you emotional while recording? <laughs> yeah. Well, I always i laughing almost every episode and I have a hard time keeping it together. I don't know what you guys are doing. You guys probably make fart noises. Never. Or Vince is doing something Vincent. inappropriate to you. <laughs> that is a fact. Vincent's the most inappropriate voice actor I've met in my entire life. Yeah, but if it's but funny. But he's so funny. Then you can get away with it. He gets away with so much. Oh, it's, it's a Oh, yeah. incredible. So basically, Vincent will do something to me, usually, to make Kelly and Paul laugh. That's usually where, because he's right here, so he'll do it to me, and then you're the audience, like, and I'm the guinea pig, like, every episode. <laughs> but I think that what they're asking is, have you ever cried? Have you ever cried? No, Michael Adams wake us. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, it's so method. Strangest thing you've ever done for voice acting? Well, when I sugar sprinkles. Um, is that pony yeah. or oh, little, little touch up? Yeah. 
there was an episode where she was angry because she didn't have any sprinkles on her head. And then they had all these like angry cat noises. And I didn't know like if they wanted me to do them or if they were gonna like dub in an actual cat. Yeah. So then in front of the whole room I was like, <laughs> and uh, it was kind of embarrassing. Have you ever read any of the Ninjago fan fictions? No. Are they good? Uh, you ever read them? Either? Yes. <laughs> you needed help with a boy in Ninjago. Which yeah. character would you go to for help in real life? In real life, yeah. who would I go to for help? Well, Sensei. Yeah, that would make sense. Okay, what if we eliminate him from the equation? Oh, Go he's like, ninja he's the ninja. most reliable one. Oh, yeah, like, you're in a jam, who do you yeah, call? I have to call my brother first. Oh, that makes sense too. If you could rewrite some aspect of Nia's character, what would you change? Okay. Shall I say it? Yeah, that's it. You could choose who Nia had a crush on. Yeah? He wrote it. Really? And so what happened was, this little girl yeah. wrote me an email and said, does Nia like better? Um, Cole, Cole. Jay, you're Cole. Yeah. And then I was like, thrown in. Uh -oh. Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point. And she was like, what do you, what do you mean? Like, is that a new ninja? What are you talking about? I'm just a girl trying to ask you a question. And I was like, exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point. And that, so I didn't really answer, like, whatever. Yeah. In my own imagination, that's who Nia would like, but I don't regret it. Um, so then I get another email from another little girl being like, Just so you know, so and so is going on Google Plus saying that you said that, that Ronin was the new ninja, and just so you know, she's telling everyone that you told her. <laughs> and I was like, Oh my gosh, what have I done? And so then I wrote this little girl message being like, can you please not attach my name to anything you're saying on um, Plus? Like, I signed it on confidentiality agreement. Confidentiality, not an Yeah, we're not allowed to give spoilers, basically. Yeah. I keep telling y'all, but... Uh, and, and I didn't actually tell her any information. Yeah. But now she's claiming that I did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So please don't do that. And she was like, oh! That was just my sibling. My sibling must have gotten a hold of my Google Plus account and said that. I'm like, who calls their brother and sister a sibling? You're an only child. Right. Stop lying to me and keep my name out of it. Because when we were little, we could say something in, in our parents' basement. Yep. And that's how we passed information on. But now, because of the internet, I write an email to a, a, a little kid in Australia yeah. and it circulates to the globe. I'm like, oh, I was just like playing around, but he can't play around. And so then, like, trust me, I like the amount of stuff you have to put up. Try doing a YouTube channel. Yeah. <laughs> That's where it gets crazy. Yeah, I bet. So if I could change the aspect, I would, she would, she would uh, date Roman and then they'd go off on adventures. Oh.